So today I have Tristan here with me. Tristan, say hi. Hello. Tristan is my 10-year-old kid. We went to Dollar Tree and we're going to pick out some cereal and we got these little containers and we are going to use those to finish making a little breakfast bar because we're going to be having company. Who's company? What we're doing is we're going to be taking these little containers that we got from the Dollar Tree and we got how many kinds of cereal? Uh, three. Four. Four. We got four things of cereal. Do you want to see what we got? We got Lucky Charms. Um, we got Captain Crunch's Crunch Berries. We also got Oops All Berries. And finally, Cocoa Pebbles. So Tristan picked all of these out. These are going to be some sugary treats. But we're kind of doing it as a special surprise for your cousin, huh? Yeah. So that you guys can have lots of variety. What's really nice about going to the Dollar Tree to get this stuff is since these are all only $1.25, you can get a big variety if you don't necessarily know what kind of cereal that everybody would like. So we're going to be taking these and we're going to be pouring them in here. Now, these containers that I got at the Dollar Tree, they're quite a bit smaller than the other ones that I got at the Dollar Tree. So I originally went to the Dollar Tree and I got some that are almost twice the size. Um, they just open just like the other ones, but they're quite a bit bigger. I was hoping to find these, but when I didn't find any more of this bigger size, I'm like, what can I do with the smaller ones? So I'm like, oh, that'd be really cute just to put different kinds of cereal in all of these. Size difference, you can see that these ones are quite a bit bigger. If you can find these in your Dollar Tree, these are amazing. But these little ones are actually really good if you're doing like a popcorn bar and you just wanted to put a little bit of candy in each one. Again, you could go to the Dollar Tree, get one small bag of candy for each one, and it'll look really full because it's small. So for this purpose, it worked out great that they had the little ones, and we'll show you how we did it. Okay, so I'm going to take these little cereal pouches that we got from the Dollar Tree that Tristan here picked out for his cousin, and we're going to let him fill them up. Yeah. So, does that sound good? Yeah. All right. So go ahead and get the first one ready. And I'll get the next one ready. You put the lid on and be really careful when you flip it over. See where the flat part is? That part goes down. Yeah, perfect. Just like that. I'm going to start on the next one. So you can see it doesn't fill it up all the way, but we are not having that many people over. We just wanted it to kind of have enough to make a cute little area without spending a lot of money. I'm going to show you how to make a quick and easy breakfast bar. First, we have some cocoa pebbles. Then we have some Captain Crunch, and we have some Crunch Berry from the same brand as the Captain Crunch, and finally we have some Lucky Charms. This is going to be seriously delicious. This is going to be a treat bar as much as it is a cereal bar, so don't come after me in the comments. My mom is putting these spoons in so it's easy for breakfast in the morning, and of course the lids. Now we're going to put the bigger dollar store containers in the back. There you have it, a quick and easy breakfast bar.